Hey everyone, this is Jay Baller, and today I'm going to show you the um, SNES emulator. So pretty much play Super Nintendo games. Um, now, what you're going to need is the app to for the emulator to play the ROMs, which you're going to have to download the ROMs for pretty much the specific games of what you want to play on your phone, and. Um, you can go to sites, you can Google it, um, Super Nintendo ROMs and stuff, and you should bring a bunch of those in there. Um, I'm going to post a site on here on my um, on this video. You can go to that site, and you should find some ROMs there, too. Um, okay, let's get right into it. Let me show you. This is pretty much the ROM. Well, actually, not the ROM, the application, which we're going to be using, which is the Snoid right here. S N E S O I D S N O I D. Now there is a free version in the market, and there is also a um, paid version. Now, the biggest thing that the paid version and the um, the free version does is you, when you're playing the game, you can actually save where you're at. Now, on the free version, they won't let you save it. Um, I have a file. APK file with the actually paid version. So if you guys want that, I can give me your email. I can send that out to you, so you don't have to pay for the paid version. Um, now I have a couple games on here. Didn't go too crazy with about a couple, and I could always add more. And I have these on my SD card. And as soon as you click on the application, it pulls up here, and you just click these arrows, and you can go in different folders of where they're at. I made my own folder in here. And I kind of remember it. Oops. Well, got a bunch of stuff. This kind of looks like Astro, if you're familiar with Astro. ROMs, there we go, and I got it all in here. Um, Got some classic games. I'm like the classic guy. We could play some, um, I don't know, let's run something here. Uh, Donkey Kong Country. Old school. Now, the keyboard pops up in here. You can disable the keyboard. I know some devices they sell the attachments on here. But you can see, game loads up. It's pretty much the actual Super Nintendo game here going on. Oh, sorry, got the video here. I can show you a couple things on here. It's pretty cool because I'm if you're a real gamer back in the days. Now you could never imagine you're playing your games from your phone. The actual Super Nintendo game. It actually takes a little bit to load, just like the actual Super Nintendo. 1994. All right, click that. One player. And you can move with that pad, see? As you move. And you can jump. Then there's a left trigger, right trigger to start. Now, okay. press your menu, gives you more options. If you want to load where you were at previously, if you want to save it, your settings. You can actually take screenshots here too. And if you go to more, it shows you screenshot. So it'll actually go in your gallery. So if you want to send it to a buddy or something, or post somewhere, like, hey, look what I'm playing. You know, it's pretty cool. Now, if you do a quick save, just click on save. And you just pick a slot. Slot one. And if I want to load, Go to load and it'll take you straight to that same scene. Okay, let's get out of that. Play something else. Got the classic on here. F0. And it's pretty much really cool. Man, with two hands, you know, no lags, no stops. I have no complaints about the application. Everything they usually updated with new cool stuff, so pretty cool. But, um,. That is pretty much it, and that is S-Noid application running with the um, ROMs of the game playing. And pretty much you got your Super Nintendo on your phone all day. And that's pretty much it. Uh, it's J-Ball, over and out.